Welcome everyone. Welcome everyone to our very first session. From Moorburong country, I will welcome you to this process and I'll say, Womanjika, welcome. Indonesia is the largest Muslim country in the world. We are also one of the most plural societies in the world. The Indonesia is not an Islamic state, but state based on Pancasila. Uh, this Pancasila literally means five principles. Talking about young Muslims today, it is important to note that there are many ways of being Muslims or expressions of Muslimness. In Indonesia, the activism of Muslim youth is at the heart of how Islam functions in Indonesia's public sphere. Many young urban Muslims are behind many moderate Muslim organizations in Indonesia. One of the strongest points of this nine wali, nine saints in Java is that they accommodate local cultures and so they spread out the message of Islam through the stories that were delivered through Wayang play, the shadow play. Contact between Muslims and the indigenous Australian population actually predates the arrival of European settlers. Our brothers and sisters in Northern Australia had a great sensitive and respectful relationship with Macassan fishermen that came. Indonesian friends are surprised that Indonesia has a long connection uh, with Australia, especially the indigenous people. There is an aspect of Islam that uh, not only observed, learned, but adopted by the indigenous communities, which is very fascinating. Reverting to Islam, there was a lot of commonality that I could see in traditional Aboriginal customary practice and way of life and Islamic traditions. Australia is a uh, you know, multicultural, multi-religious society, so it's natural that we have a lot of interfaith engagement and interactions. When we look at the question of Muslims in Australia, there's a diversity of the ways in which Muslim women and men have been making their contribution to Australia as Australian citizens of Muslim background. We talk also about the similarity between Islam in Indonesia and in Australia, like diversity and one fighting, not one sighting. We have Muslims in this country from over 160 other countries. A majority of Muslims in Australia feel connected to the country, connected to the people. They feel a sense of Australianness. They feel a sense of belonging.